Hi YouTube, I am back with another pick a card. This is going to be a quick message, okay? Because I just did the third party energy. So, I wanted to do something for the ones that are not in a third party. So, let's get started, which is going to be really, really quick. Let's get started here. Okay, so go ahead and make your selection. It's just going to be a quick love update message and we'll get started Let's see number ones i lost my numbers my letters <laughs> so i do new ones okay number one. Oh, okay i don't read reversals of course i'm not sure if my my deck was upside down or not i didn't even check so <laughs> Okay, we have romance here. Let's see, why is romance here for number ones, group ones? That's pretty good. I sense a gift or a date or spending time with someone here. Ooh, somebody from the past. There could be somebody from the past wanting to come back. Ooh, someone you cut off. Let's see. Someone here is not knowing if they should cut this off because I feel like someone here is romanticizing the past, but there was a very big disappointment. Give me more on this death card for number ones. Yeah, you invested a lot in this. You invested a lot in this and... There could have been a third party situation, but somebody here, I feel like you don't know what to do if you should leave or not, um, because you're so hopeful for this reconnection. Mm -hmm. There was something that was cut off here and you invested a lot of time in this. Mm -hmm. Someone here is hoping for a reconnection. Somebody here is wanting this new beginning. The problem here is that somebody is not taking a leap of faith here. Somebody, for some of you, this person is going to come back and you're not going to know if you should have faith in this situation or if you should go for it here and reconnect with this person. You're going to be kind of blocked off here, but somebody doesn't want to cut it off for some of you. For others of you, you're hoping for this. You're really thinking a lot about it. Somebody's not making a move, taking a leap of faith forward. That is what I'm getting here. And do see water, earth, Scorpio. Could be a Gemini. Water again. Pisces, Aries, fire signs. Yeah. Okay. So that's for number one. Let's go number two. Oh, I did have my whole cards upside down. So it's number 11, divine timing. I feel like you've been waiting for a long time. Mm, or it seems like a long time for you. I think you're close. You're close to the end though. Like, let's see. What is it that you're waiting for? Okay, Five of Swords wants to come out. You probably had some harsh communication with this person on the last encounter. Something like that. There was some ego, pride, mind games here. Okay, Divine Timing. Someone wants to clear the air here. Makes Wants to make things right. Apologize. Yep, because there's love there. Pretty straightforward here. Give me more on this. Justice. Why is justice here? Yep. Somebody's ready to take action. They could be from another country across the, you know, at a distance from you. But I feel like you gave a lot to this. There is still love here. And somebody here is thinking about how to send you a message. 
is probably discussing it with a friend here somebody that's not being truthful to them could be as well interesting that's only from probably one person okay so it's only a matter of time but that's what i'm getting here because with the lovers here they want to make things right with the six of swords and the justice interesting oh i did see gemini there fire signs leo libra air signs scorpio cancer could be okay and pisces number three let's see what we have quick message here i had my whole cards upside down and i didn't even realize till right now so we have four of wands here the sparks okay be careful if you just met someone it could fizzle out right away or somebody's coming back around you're gonna be happy you're gonna celebrate you're gonna but it could fizzle out right away okay because these are the sparks these are um, sparklies <laughs> you know the ones that we turn on for fourth of july you know how they they fizzle out right away so be careful let's see give me more on this it could also signify a celebration here let's see someone here is holding back or you're healing gaining your strength back Ooh, i see celebration here see leo yep someone here wants to come around but they're not they miss you they miss the love they felt with you the closeness with you give me more on this there could be family involved here kids they want to clear the air they want to apologize for something for being a sneak a liar a thief <laughs> a thief of your time and love here give me more of this seven of swords yep for being toxic for probably having someone else there a third party mm -hmm. why do i want to get this yep a third party and not telling you about it there's something here here so somebody here wants to make you know apologize for it there was an ending here a lot of things that you were not told interesting so now they want to come back with a message don't get ahead of yourself because it could fizzle out again okay you might be waiting for this as well Mm -hmm. problem is that right now they're trying to figure out how to message you online maybe they're stuck yeah okay so be careful for some of you this is fire i see capricorn i see scorpio i see air i see pisces water and leo could be a sag too okay so that is what i'm getting for number four i mean threes <laughs> interesting okay four quick message four in love follow your heart that's more like advice for someone a reality check because we're going to real veal and cordis i forgot what cordis means think that's follow your heart your heart here yep it's time to leave a situation that's been draining you this is more like advice for you yep and start a new beginning here some of you are probably already doing this you're going towards something more serious more long term oh could be someone new here a water sign earth sign somebody that is a flirt somebody that could be a little younger than you mm -hmm. i do sense that it's a little long younger than you
It's new love. You're going towards new love long term. Ooh. Why is this judgment here? You're going to make a judgment call here. You're going to follow your intuition and let the past go. Mm -hmm. The problem here is that the past is still there, lingering. You have to heal from it. Let go. Make a final judgment call here. Follow your intuition because the past was a lot of disappointments here. You're on to something new here. Letting go of the past. Getting your courage back. Your healing Mm -hmm. new love in front of you follow your heart you've gone through a transformation for some of you it was really difficult for you but you've you you're making it okay pretty good so some of you it's advice for some of you you're already doing it okay you're on the right path so i have water leo pisces aries could be a gemini a sag i feel too i don't know why i feel sag here they're the traveler the earth science water okay i hope that felt like it resonated thank you so much and i'll be back later with another pick a card Bye.